Hi guys and welcome to my channel. Today I will be building a shelf with these crates that I had purchased long time ago and I'm finally getting around to do it. So the first step is I am going to assemble it and use wood glue to glue them together. So I do think that I'm going to have to screw the sides. So the shelf is done now, I just put extra weight, some weight, some clamps um, to weigh it down and then I'm going to wait 24 hours for it to dry and then I'm going to paint it. I'm not sure if I'm going to add the top to it or not, most likely I will. So it had a chance to dry, a painting, that the paint that I'm using is Chateau Grey by Annie Sloan, it's chalk paint. And I will be most likely using black wax to finish it off and then clear wax the whole thing. The paintbrush that I'm using is Legacy and again I'm not 100% sure, I think it came from Home Depot. And the waxing brushes are any Sloan wax brush and then I just have a dollar store brush that I use for wax. I had flipped it so I can do what's bottom now and then I'm gonna do the sides and the top. Now for all the little crevices I'm going to use a small sponge brush. One more night, one more night
just so you see the foam brush wasn't the best choice this is what ends up happening when the wood is rough and completely fell apart but it's done now the first coat I don't think I'm gonna be applying the second coat because I'm gonna be applying the black wax but I'm gonna let it dry and then I'm gonna apply black wax directly to it I'm not gonna put a coat of clear wax before it I'm gonna go just directly with black wax so the crates had a chance to dry the glue dried everything dried so I'm going to apply black wax now done the wax is on I did not do the top because I will be putting the stained piece on top and I'm gonna leave it to cure for a little bit before I apply the clear wax so I will be staining this piece of wood with the ultra wood stain the light have a light and it's the very thin uh in dark walnut I'm just going to do the top and this edge because this is gonna sit on on the top of the boxes anyways and you won't be able to see it so much better I am using the high performance water-based top coat by general finishes and um, I'm just going to use a brush and I'm just applying one coat and I let the wood dry for about two hours you don't have to hide it baby let your head down be a little wilder baby kick your shoes off don't So it is all done. I just have to finish up this part here because I had to end up, end up having to cut it because I thought I ha had it right, but it was too long. Well, it's better to be too long than too short, I guess. And I'm gonna decorate it and show you what it looks like all decorated here. <laughs> 